Hey guys, welcome to Season 2, Episode 7 of The Mentalist. Here we go. Oh. Is this a Red John thing, or is this just some other case? Jane? Listen, what are you doing here? What do you think? Guns around is what you're doing. Can you just put your guns away, please? Cowboys. <laughs> oh my god, they probably lost their mind when they came in. Like, ah. <laughs> you have an ID? Not yet. Yes, yet. Our report just came in, and the corpse is Colin Hamer. Hamer. Why do I recognize that name? Colin Hamer was a kidnapped victim three years ago. Early 20s from San Francisco, wealthy family. Oh, this could Doesn't be the same. The case, family paid the ransom. That didn't work. You're really similar to your kidnapping, yeah, don't you think? could be very s about Colin Hamer's same kidnapping person. The same kidnappers that kidnapped me in Westlake. Well, could be a coincidence. There are no coincidences. I agree. I want your people teaming up on this. No. Is that necessary? I believe it is. Let's stop stumbling into each other and try working together. Oh, God, son of a gun. How about not concerns? I do. This man, uh, I, I, I don't even know what he is. He's an accident waiting to happen. Sam, yeah, be fair. He, he closes cases, I know. This is copies of the case paperwork so far. Now, the kidnappers forced her car off the road, killed the driver, and then took her. Why kill the driver? It's a message. They won't hesitate to kill the hostage if they don't get what they want. Yes. There's no ransom demand yet. How do we know it's a, it's a visual thing? We sent the family a proof of life a few hours later. It's no blindfold. It's not good. It means they don't care if she sees anything. Yeah. Good thinking. That means they're willing to kill her. What's your problem? It's a thinking out loud class, you no dipshit. Hey. Fuck that guy. He's correct. This is shaping Screw up him. Like the hammer. I don't like your whole it's team, true. man. I gotta get back to the Westlands. I'd like to come with if that's all right. To contact the family, set up interviews. And I'd like to leave Hicks here to work with your team. That's all right with you? Okay. Keep him honest. Hey. Is it? Can you refrain that, Sam? No. They're Jane's people. But they need watching. I like to think of them as my people. Well, think what you like. I can't have them trying to pull some cheap stunt behind my back. Well, oh, God! Expensive stunts if you don't like the cheap ones. I understand your issue, Agent Bosco. No problem. This is Verona, Wesley. This is Mia's sister. You must be CBI too. Oh my I'm God! Patrick Jane. It's Hotch's wife. My friend Duncan Weaver. Hey, more CBI. Where did you guys come from anyway? Uh, two days ago, I never heard of you. You guys must be loaded. How'd you make the money? Uh, my grandfather actually. Oil, lumber. Oh, I just assumed it was new money. Because of the, uh, the decor. Uh, already? You're starting with this crap? What? What? Uh, Belinda Sanborn, Verona's attorney. Any conversation? I hate that guy so much. Oh, oh my god. Be there. Not a problem. Is there someone else in the family we should be talking to? We understand you're investigating a related case. Another kidnapping that may have been carried out by the same people, yes. How did it, um... Nah, you don't want to. Turn out to the to the person they took it home, okay? No, he was killed. His name was Colin Hamer. Here's his picture. He's from Pacific Heights. Does he look familiar? No. He looks familiar to me. No, sorry. This is Kent. Please keep her in her room. We discussed this. Yes. Excuse me. Sorry. 
I don't, I don't think you should pay. I definitely don't think you should pay. Is it a text document? You want me to read this? Okay. My name is Mia Westlake. I am not hurt. I am being treated well. For my safe return, you must pay $3.75 million in small, consequential bills. This money is to be ready by 6 p.m. tonight. That's a specific number. You will be instructed what to do then. Failure Why not four? Why not three and a half? Why 3.75? In my immediate execution. <gasps> Any interference will result in my I, I, I think they might act, they might kill her regardless. I'm not gonna get anything out of the Westlakes now. Let's go. Okay. Okay. Three point seven five million. Very specific number, don't you think? Mm hmm Maybe the kidnappers had their eye on the Westlake's bank account. I'll talk to Bosco about it. Then we'll go. Okay. Your sister needs you here now. As comforting as it might be to crawl under the blanket of narcotics that your husband has so generously procured for you, it's better that you don't. Nothing I do is going to help her. Probably right. What's the point? What you can accomplish is irrelevant. But if you are absent in this moment, you will regret it for the rest of what will be a miserable life. I know what this is about. Bosco's got the Red John file. You think if you hang around long enough, you'll weasel your way into it. Weasel's a little strong. If your voice is coming, Bosco will never go for it. Never. What? I'll never go for what? Elizabeth, you claim to have control over this whack job. Why don't you do me a favor and walk him away? Don't talk to me that way. Yeah, it's very but rude. quiet. But Manelli gave us specific orders. I don't give a flying... Hey, hey! Hey. You the agent's boss? Why? I want him removed from this case now. Now, all right? He's he's disrespectful and uh, rude and, and unprofessional. Oh, he's just angry because I called him on his little job. Yeah, thank you. Okay, you're nuts. I demand you take this man off the case or there'll be serious consequences. <laughs> well, sir, that's not your call. Oh, yeah? You think? One phone call. I can have you direct in traffic. Is that right? Yeah. It is. So we'll make your call because this man's staying on the case whether you like it or not. Really? Yeah. If you see, see this, you see this done to my wife. I mean, this guy's out of control. Shut up, Lincoln. Maybe I was trying to. Shut up. Mr. James, is it? Yeah. What you said earlier was right. Thank you. I guess. <laughs> Leave him alone. <laughs> okay then, let's settle. No fun, boys. So, that name is so with gonna fall off the desk? For a while. Changed my mind, I went in through Z. Oscar Steen calls us Bert and Ernie. You knew that? You didn't say anything? It would bother you. It doesn't bother you? No. He's <laughs> a clever, handsome one. No. Where's Jay? With Bosco? I've been checking out the house where we found Colin Hammer's body. It's been abandoned seven years. There were some complaints about squatters five, six years ago. Nothing else. Seven Agent years. Agent Christian, there's a Lewis Erlin to see you in your office. Thanks for coming. Will we please? I'm retired. This so we guy. Found poor Colin Hammer. We did. You were the SFPD officer in charge of the kidnapping investigation, right? I was. Well, we were wondering if maybe it was an inside job. The ransom demand was pretty specific. Mm -hmm. We considered that. I always had a feeling about Colin's girlfriend. Nothing solid, just a feeling. Do you remember her name? Diane Z Zoransky. Yeah. Talked to her a couple of times. Diane What's the ransom drop? Tonight, 6 o'clock. Uh, night Colin's ransom got paid. Don't think we said 10 words. He never appeared. If it is the same people, 
that took Colin. You do this girl's family a favor. Money drops at 6 at 601. You tell them their child is dead. Give them a chance to get used to it. It would be a kindness. I don't think you should be paying them. And this has to do with Colin Hamer how? Apparently they also sold drugs that they bought from border cartels. And they picked up some of the cartels' habits. Like kidnapping for cash. So they went from dealing pot to kidnapping wealthy kids. Less effort, more profit. Do you names? They're known as the Crazy Hill Gang. One of the ringleaders was nicknamed Deezer. Nobody knows his real name. Apparently That's Deezer's been hanging around our apartment building in West Oakland. Where's your best stop? Don't need one. Sure you do. We're just canvassing. For people called the Crazy Hill Gang, you should wear a vest. Look, it's hot. It's uncomfortable. Hicks isn't wearing one. What, you're afraid he might find you? No. Not at all. Yes, yes you are. Okay, idiot. Come with us. One more. She likes you. She has good taste. <laughs> you go for children. Unlike your employers? I don't know what you mean. Oh, come on. It's they have a kid and they're not good. About the yeah. I don't know anything about that. Okay, we got an error to run. Okay. Okay. All right. <laughs> Gotta go. Gotta go run an error with the big series. Come on, let's go. So what's the deal here? Well, the tattoo on the kidnapper's arm suggests the uh, Mexican mafia might be involved. Mm-hmm. Those guys? The members. So, we're gonna go talk to them. Mm-mm. It looks scary. Yeah, that's scary. You're gonna you talk to them? full member until you've killed someone. That's cool. Maybe I'll just find the car. No. Come with me. I need you for backup. Backup? He doesn't even have a gun. Hey. Keep walking, man. Who are you? Why are you being that way? I asked you nicely. I, I, I Your name is Raul. And I ain't got no warrants, so back up, fool. Well, Raul, you and me are gonna have to go have a private chat in a moment. Nah. I ain't did nothing wrong. You're about to. Don't make it difficult. How about you? Come on. Come on. Anybody else? You? You? All right. I'm waiting. Move! That's right. Move! That's right. Thank you. <laughs> so, how long have you been an informant for the CBI, Raul? What are you talking about, man? What informant? Oh, come on. You can come clean with me. So who is this guy, Sam? Huh? What'd you tell him? What's going on? Uh, just nice. Oh, that's kind of obvious. Oh, that was good. As if they'd want me for backup. I mean, really. Well, we saw M8 tats from the kidnappers. Come on, anybody can get a tattoo. Yeah, they were kind of showy, a little too visible. Yeah, it's like they wanted you to think that. Yeah. You know, that kind of stuff is getting to be a real problem. Hey. Thanks. That was fun. No actual progress, but uh, certainly a lesson in life on the main streets. Yeah, well, that's what cops do. We get a lead, we run it down. Most leads don't work out, we move on. But you don't understand that, do you? Uh, that's this kind of hard, methodical work we do is somehow beneath you. <laughs> Not your speed. Oh, please, get off your horse. Honestly. This one fried me and impressed me with your macho cup prowess. You shouldn't be working with us. You're hurting people. You know that? Who? The cops you work with. Don't kid yourself. Their careers are taking a hit. I'll piss off. about them, you'll leave. Cops have worked with many Lisbon. And her team. But mostly Lisbon. Sure. And yes, it could mean there's someone on the inside. Be useful to know who it is, don't you think? Well, we'll work on that. But the ransom drops in three hours. If we make a move on a suspect now, all it'll do is spook the kidnappers. They'll kill me uh, and they'll scatter. Okay, but then what can you She's do? You're not going to be safe. They will kill her five minutes after they get the ransom. Honestly. So she dies either way. If you try something. No. You want to hear what I have to say? Not interested. Okay, sure. All right. Well, I was very impressed, by the way, with the Lutcho Cop prowess. And those guys, they were genuinely frightening you. You're absolutely cool, man. Good out there. Go with Bullet. Like, really cool. Kojak. You want me to spy on my neighbors. Fascist. <laughs> Enough of the bird, alright, X. What? 
Sorry. Hurt your feelings? It's just not funny, that's all. Sorry, never heard of them. Alright. Alright, people have clearly heard of them and they're just not answering. Idiot. Uh, not you. Um, Wynn Rigsby, CBI. Need to ask you a couple of questions. Ma'am, I was wondering if I could leave a card with Holy shit! Go! God! Can't see the blood. That's why you. That's why you wear a vest. Wowzers. Don't ever do this to me again. No problem. Oh my god, if that was Rigsby that got shot, I would have lost my shit more because I knew he wasn't wearing a vest. I love you. Thanks. I have to go. They, they don't even know I'm here. I'll, I'll call you later. <laughs> What's that for? Next time, wear your vest. Okay. I mean it. Yeah. Are they gonna be standing there when he gets out? That'd be hilarious. Oh, damn. That kind of bad blood starts with us. She's right. This isn't about bad blood, it's about professionalism. There you go again. You won't take any responsibility. Ivy says the shooter's name is Diane Zaransky. Okay. Nope, DZ. Deezer. Diane Zaransky was Colin Hammer's girlfriend. SFPD suspected her of being in the gang that kidnapped him. The Crazy Hill gang. Same crew must have kidnapped me in Westlake. Well, now I know for sure they have someone playing in the Westlake house. That's the way they work. We'll run background checks on everybody that's been inside okay. that house for the past six months. So she was not going to catch anyone with a background check. They've planned too carefully for that. You know how many cases he's closed for us? You think he's given me bad habits? I think he's made me a better cop. Thank you, Lisbon. Can it's I just... Quiet. Can I just... Okay. If you're so sure you're right that you won't even listen to him, then you're not a person I know. Oh! Damn! Damn. Mm. You are not welcome here. Okay. Tell Manila you refuse oh, to work with me. You can face him. How do you like that? You know, you really are a schoolboy. You know that? Just a Now we're gonna do exactly as the kidnappers have asked. That is the best way to ensure that your sister will get home safely. One of the kidnappers is in this house right now. Yes. Here. A spy, a mole reporting back to those that are holding your sister. We should be talking to them, not playing with Star Wars toys. <laughs> oh my god, who? Is it him? Is it her? Her. You <laughs> Is it not her? That makes me think it's not her. Oh, what? No, 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 no. The, uh, the, the, Somebody better come. the, the babysitter, what is her name? The, what does she do? Does? 
You just killed me and Westlake. Blame, 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 blame. Somebody's coming, don't worry. And there they are. Perfect. Oh, this is kicked. Monday's on its way. It's clean. They tried planning a tracker, but I caught it. Get the girl ready. Hands where I can see them. Hands, What's hands. Going on? Don't no. look, don't do anything unless I tell you to. Well, I don't understand. The baby is sleeping. Oh, we're gonna go get her. Good luck finding her. You don't need luck. We have your stupid cell phone, dumbass. <laughs> it's a landline. Oh, that's good. 1867 Cliff Point Circle, Oakland. Call Oakland PD, tell them we're taking the house. Oh, let's go. I think he's gained some respect for him. Thought I would resurrect an old tequila tradition. <laughs> tequila! Da 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 da. You know that thing you said about Jane making you a better cop? You don't believe that. I may have exaggerated for effect. I wanted to say he makes that everyone nice working with you again. more successful. <laughs> He's borderline tolerable at the end of this episode. <laughs> oh, boys. I've been thinking. Oh. You're not a cop. Mm -mm. You never will be. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. You have a useful perspective. This is a summary of the Red John case since I took over. Bosco, don't thank me. I wasn't going to. I need the actual case file. Unabridged. You're a jerk. You know that? Night, <laughs> Bosco. Nice. He's getting better. At the, at the second half of the episode, I was like, all right, all right, I can tolerate this guy. He's all right for now. We'll see how it goes. Am I the only one... Now, I I mean, unless you're watching this along with me, like like you're watching an episode and then you're watching my reactions, well, how some people actually do that. Um, this is more for y'all because... If you've already seen the show, then you probably already know if, if this is a legitimate feeling that I have or not. I feel like he's gonna die. The Bosco guy. I don't, I don't know when. I feel like it's gonna be sooner rather than later. But I have that feeling. Like, with a show like this, they really haven't killed off really any character that is of known. Um... I could see him dying. Like, if not this season, like, the next season. I could see it. And I'm, like, getting those vibes. So, that's just where I'm feeling right now. And, and if you're watching this with me, like, if you're watching... Because, like I said earlier, some people watch the show, like, watch this episode, and then they come and they watch my reaction to it. If you're doing that, 
are you are we on the same page? Like, do you get that vibe too? Because that's what I'm feeling. I'm 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 getting that that vibe. And it's hard to explain. It's a television thing. It's a TV show thing. Like sometimes you just this motherfucker's about to die. Like I'm I'm feeling it. I don't know when it is. I don't know if it's like pending, like within a couple episodes, or if it's like this season or the next. But I can see, I can so see it. Like the video, comment down below, subscribe if you have not already. You can get these videos early. SimpleReactions.com, Patreon.com slash SimpleReactions. Check out all the social medias down in the description of every single video. I will see y'all next time.